New Orleans Saints fans are in a state of shock after the team's terrible defeat against the Houston Texans in Week 6. Just last Sunday, the Saints enjoyed a convincing victory over the Patriots, and the question on everyone's mind was whether they were the real Saints. Unfortunately, this week revealed that they were not. The Saints had multiple opportunities to win the game against the Texans, but they failed in the red zone and made costly mistakes. Blake Group's missed kick from inside the 30-yard line is almost unforgivable, and the decision to go for four consecutive shots in the end zone at the end of the game left much to be desired. The team couldn't find its identity at a critical moment. The offensive line also suffered serious problems. James Hurst's injury and Ryan Ramzik's concussion left the team in a critical situation. The need to involve practice squad players like Cameron Irving, Mark Evans, and Tommy Kramer is a nightmare scenario for New Orleans. Another chronic problem for the Saints has been the lack of cohesion between the three phases of the game. The Saints' defense was overwhelmed in the first half, while the offense couldn't capitalize on opportunities in the second half, including group's missed field goal. New Orleans seems to be its worst enemy, and the players and coaches must take responsibility for improving their performance. Running back Alvin Kamara emphasized the need for sacrifice and responsibility on the team. He stated that all players must find a way to win and believe in themselves to overcome challenges. On the other hand, the Texans showed promise as a team with a bright future. With coach D'Amico Ryans at the helm and a strong performance from C.J. Stroud, the Texans could become an interesting contender in the future. With a short week before their next game, the Saints face pressing questions and an urgent need to find solutions to avoid more disasters like the one that occurred in week 6. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel to continue receiving the latest Saints news and give this video a like to support the channel.